a new TV show to binge on then. Anatomy of a Scandal could be just for you. Rupert Friend and Sienna Miller are at the centre of the scandal. Now, before we talk to them, let's have a quick look at what we can expect. Oh, it looks good. It looks juicy. <laughs> good. Yeah. It, it looks like one of those uh, dramas that builds and builds and builds and builds. So it starts off all nice and lovely and then there's a twist and then there's an explosion and there's an, oh, dear. Yeah. Um, we won't get to the end. But as actors playing this intense role that from the start has a journey, it must be quite exciting. It must be a real challenge, Rupert. Yeah, I mean, the, the scripts came in and each one ends with a gut punch, you know, and as you said, it escalates and as the episodes go along, it's twist after twist after twist and you... Reading them, we got kind of breathless. And about you? Yes, a few gasps. A few gasps. <laughs> <laughs> there are proper twists that I did not see coming, which is exactly what you want, I think, in a six-part drama. Mm. So, Sienna, your character was quite tricky because you had to keep a lot back. There's a lot yes. of layers to your character. Was she quite tricky to play? Only in the sense of just of playing someone contained because I don't have that ability in real life to hide anything <laughs> whatsoever. So... I imagined it would be easier than it was to just absolutely hold back, but quite fun. So you're nothing like your character in real life? No, I mean, there are some similarities. There always is, like, little ingredients, but on the whole, no, I don't hide much. Rupert, just give us a quick overview of what it's about. So it centres around a Conservative politician and his family, and his wife is played by Sienna, uh, and there's a sex scandal um, which comes you know, out in the first episode and basically goes from bad to worse and he basically has his entire career crumbling around him and his family and makes a mess of... You've ruined family. everyone's lives <laughs> in this. Yeah, in this. You, there in is this. no in one who is not this. absolutely destroyed Well, that is the thing. Every, sing every <laughs> single other character my character has wronged. So I'm just the pariah of the yeah. show. And, mm. you, and you found that quite tricky, didn't you, Rupert, to play somebody like that? I mean, you were a bit yeah. hesitant about the role at first. Yeah, it? that's right. I, um, I didn't find the world of kind of privileged, elite politicians particularly attractive for some reason. <laughs> <laughs> so in the end, it was like, uh, why am I doing this? And, you know, our brilliant director, S.J. Clarkson, uh, gave me a wonderful set of challenges which I couldn't resist uh, as an actor. You're both obviously very, very talented. And when you're working opposite someone who is uh, as, as, as talented as you. Is it easier or is it more difficult? Do you go out to impress or do you do, you, do, you do a lot of rehearsals? How does it all come about? How do you build that? How do I manage to act with this talent? <laughs> <laughs> exactly. But yeah. you know, because this is the you talking about <laughs> <was> it daunting <laughs> scene. It must have been daunting a bit. I was really intimidated <laughs> by you. Yeah. Um, no, I think the better the actor, the, the more elevated you will be. I mean, it's that's what you hope yeah, for. Yeah, it raises the bar. If you're yeah. working with great people, you kind of think, oh, I better step up here. Yeah, well, the chemistry works, because we, we've got a clip. Let's show the clip. <sighs> oh, apparently not. Yeah. I love oh, there's it. the twist. Yeah. Um, One of my favourite lines, yeah. apparently not. <laughs> you have Idiot. the moral high ground on that <laughs> one. Yeah, I mean, and continue to hold on to it for the rest of the show. That's true, and yeah. probably the rest of our friendship. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, and Sienna, without getting too political, was it easy to find a politician to emulate uh, in this show? I, I sort of did that thing where I looked up interviews of politicians and their wives and, and just saw how they would stand in a press conference, but it wasn't particularly useful because we had this novel by Sarah Vaughan and the series is based on the novel and in that she really goes into detail about everybody's interior thoughts and everything that you, you know, any given situation that's in the script, she's got a whole chapter about. So it was really... That became the Bible for us. Is it a true story then? No, it's based on a novel, but it's... But, no, I'm sure she would say that there were, there were things that she drew on. She went to Oxford. She has had experience of that mm. um, university. But I... No, no, it's fiction. But we, we, as, as, but. as we observe <laughs> politics... But. It's an parliament. interesting week for yeah. the show. <laughs> exactly, exactly. As we yeah. observe, we all, you know, these things happen in politics and, and we see uh, politicians' worlds come crumbling down. But for you guys to reenact that and get a sense of what it's like, it, it's really high pressure and, and, you know, it's not nice, is it? No, I mean, the, the, you're basically enacting a very private thing in, on the public stage. And as Sienna said, we're, si we're seeing that going on quite a lot, mentioning no names, but, you know, it's, um, it must be quite a distressing thing to go through. I mean, we had, only had to pretend, but... Yeah, anything public, anything personal made public isn't pleasant. So we, yeah, but we laughed our way through much of it. Laughed and ate. Laughed and ate. A lot of snacks. I like it. I like the sound yeah. of this. Yeah. But, and you've got a great cast. You've got Michelle Doherty as well. Doherty, yeah. She's the best. She is the best. And Naomi Scott. Naomi Scott, Josette Simon. Josette Simon, who's astounding. Yeah. And what a cast. 
And I've got to ask you, uh, you're, you're in the old uh, Obi-Wan Kenobi on Disney+. Plus. Yes, sir. Uh, how's that, oh. Rupert? I know you can't give anything away. Uh, yeah, the voice. Uh, no, you can't have the voice. Can't have anything. You can't have anything. Can't have the face, can't have the look, can't have the lightsabers, none of it. But I did. I had it all, obviously. You just... <laughs> was, that, was, that there it is. was that shot at Pinewood? No, in uh, California. Oh, really? Los Angeles, oh. yeah. It's amazing what Disney are doing with that franchise, isn't it? I know. They've got so many stories broken off, but they're all such high quality and... I don't know, I, it was a thrilling thing to be a part of. I, I'll get, tell you a little secret, Rupert. Go on. They used to call me Lobie, one Kenobi at school. Oh, because yeah? Because my earlobes are so fat. <laughs> <laughs> that is the best. <laughs> oh, they're massive. Oh, my God, so, they yeah. are. So you've got Obi one Kenobi, but I was Lobie one Kenobi. You're Lobie one Kenobi. Yeah. Well, it's nice to meet you, Lobie. <laughs> Thank you, that's, that's great. I love that you're owning that story. Well, yeah, but I, I like it. And every time I see Obi wan Kenobi, it always reminds me of my fat earlobes. <laughs> <laughs> There you go. <laughs> and, you know, as handsome as you are, yeah. she just couldn't stop talking yeah. about her earlobe. Uh, <laughs> Rupert's coming in. Right, that's lovely. Incredibly oh, small ears. Tiny mutant really ears. Tiny. Really tiny. Oh, they are, but they're cute, though. They are. Thank you. Yeah. yeah. I don't <laughs> think... At least see your face. Is that, thank, what's yeah. your earlobes? I'm not going to say this. That would be... I, I, you know, yeah, you can't. Sorry. I, I dug myself a Welcome hole. Welcome this I? morning. Thanks. <laughs> We're just waking up over here. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah, so congratulations and good luck. Uh, Six-part drama on Netflix. It's one of those that you can sit down, you can download, you can binge watch. Uh, and this is kind of the, the, the revolution, isn't it? The evolution of television and how we watch TV. It must be great to be on that platform because everyone talks about every show that's on there. Yeah, and that six-part format, as I said, is so great because if you want to, you could sit down on Friday and just do it. Yeah. And I probably, that's probably what will happen because it's yeah, quite addictive. I cannot addictive. wait. That's what Get I'm going to be doing iPad. Friday. This Friday, guys. Absolutely. Uh, Sienna, Rupert, lovely to see you. Thank, Thank you very much. You. Thank you. Thanks, Sienna. Thanks, Rupert. Thanks, Thank guys. you.